Radhe Radhe Hare Krishna to all the dear listeners. Today I would want to uh, discuss about our potentials and uh, why is it is really very important to discover and explore to the best of our potential or uh, in other words uh, to say that to maximize the use of the capabilities and potential that are given to us. So uh, once I have read about it that there uh, mainly there are three kind of capabilities or potential uh, emotional capability and intellectual capability and physical capability broadly defining them. So we all possess these three kinds of capabilities and it is really important to engage our capabilities to some meaningful or proper use. Otherwise, if we don't really employ our capacities or our possibilities to maximum, then they start becoming the problems. You know, you must have uh, heard many times or read it that your own intelligence becomes your problem if it is not put to proper use. So, talking about those capabilities, the physical capability. So, your body is capable of a lot of physical stuff and task and uh, that are your uh, powers that are given to you by nature or by almighty uh, in whatever way you would uh, like to put it so you have a certain amount of physical power and physical strength and you should perform the tasks that use that physical strength or your physical capacity if you do not do that then that physical energy that, that is stored in your body will start troubling you. So, suppose if your body, suppose, uh, not suppose actually, but this is a fact that when we are young or at any age, our body is capable to do a lot of physical work. And that is the main purpose of the body to be active physically. And uh, those people who are engaged in uh, physical activities like a sports person or normal uh, normal day-to-day uh, -day life people also or the farmers or laborers or whoever is using their physical capacity to to the best of it so it becomes good for them and you know their physical capacity does not become a problem for them because they have already used it right Similarly, there are intellectual capacities. Suppose if, uh, and uh, I would say that intellectual capabilities may differ from people to people and we should actually, you know, engage ourselves in intellectual tasks, tasks that use our intellectual capacity. Because uh, unless uh, we use our intelligence and intellect to right thing, it will, it will be used uh, in a better way. If we do not use our intellect or intelligence in some meaningful thing, then that intelligence starts becoming a mental problem. And nowadays when we uh, experience and we hear about a lot of these stress and depression stories, uh, where if you would analyze it, there is not actually some real problem. People are simply, you know, troubled by their own thoughts, their own memories, their own anxieties, imaginations. Have you heard about all these things? Anxiety, stress, and a lot of other modern day mental problems. These mental problems are simply because the intelligence and intellect that is given to us by nature and intellect as a human being, that is not put to some proper use. Because if you are engaged in some creative thing or a task where you properly use your intellect, then you know there would not be possibility to your intellect to trouble you so i would i would say that if you uh, use your possibilities in a better way they do not become a problem and if you do not explore your possibilities in a perfect way or the way that is supposed to be your possibilities become problem for yourself similar is the case with the third kind of capability emotional capability we are human beings and of course we have some emotional value uh, different people have different kind of emotions, different uh, extent of emotions. Some people are more emotional, some people are less emotional. So, uh, we are given this emotional strength or... So, we must exercise them or we must, uh, you know, explore our emotions in our relationships. 
because uh, if suppose we have the uh, i would uh, rather like to put it uh, in uh, in a way that we have the capacity to love right we have the capacity to care so if we have this capacity to love and care and if we are not you know uh, caring our people or our our close ones or dear ones or we are not extending our emotional potential or emotional strength to some meaningful thing then that also will cause problems to our mind maybe body also so also i would want to say that it is not really important or it is uh, it does not mean that you should only be emotional and caring for your own family members you should be kind emotional in general also for example for uh, uh, emotional and kind towards the whole humanity or to to those people who are in crisis or to those people who are in need like there are uh, many people in the world who have problem with meeting the necessary ends the uh, basic amenities of life there are children who are very poor and they really need our helping hand and support so we should explore our emotional potential in order to uh, extend a helping hand to all these people who are in need so <clears throat> this is what i would uh, want to share today that uh, uh, the purpose of human life is not just to you know manage their basic needs or to make money uh, to some extent but i think the purpose of human life and as i have uh, read and uh, listened to many uh, intelligent and enlightened people also the purpose of human life is to explore your capacities all kinds of capacities whether be whether they be physical or intellectual or emotional and uh, we can also further divide these into many other categories but broadly speaking these are the things so <clears throat> like uh, for example i would say that i have started uh, practicing this uh, english practice so it's not some very big task that i am doing nothing much to think about but you know i find it nice to do because this is how i am exploring my potential i am exploring uh i am putting my mind to use when i speak and this is only helping me this is only adding something to my skill nobody is perfect i am also not perfect i am actually way far from perfection and uh, and i am not also targeting the perfection you know i am just trying to be better every day in whatever things i do so this english practice thing is definitely helping me and uh, yeah i would want to explore more my physical capacities because these days uh, i am on break with uh, this workout thing but uh, it is very important and uh, uh, the one thing that i really understand but i really fail sometimes to put it into practice is that you know you should not make targets like you should not make uh, things in mind that only up to this much if i do then then only it would be meaningful thing for example i have these you know goals and targets in mind that i must do these kind of workouts these kind of exercises then only it would be meaningful and many times i really fail to find the time and energy to <clears throat> do those kind of exercises but that time i should at least do some jogging a half an hour of walking uh, a half an hour of running or jogging that is that can be done any time but i sometimes or uh, in fact many times i fail to do this so just just be con- consistent it is not really necessary that every day you will do some extraordinary kind of effort yes it is great that if you can do extraordinary efforts or uh, above average kind of efforts that will of course lead to better results but when you do not have the uh, energy and uh, motivation to do something extra so it is not bad that you do something normal like simply running and jogging are, are nice things to explore your physical potential on daily basis so uh, i would want to suggest you people to um, be like that and i would also want to be like this so let's look forward to improvement in our lives this let us become let us all become the best version of ourselves no need to compare with other people of course inspiration is another thing you can take inspiration from other people but there is no need to compare yourself or to become like anyone else because you are unique just explore what you are don't go from this world world or earth without exploring actually that what you were capable of that is what i would want to say at last thank you for listening please take care keep practicing radhe radhe hari krishna